I want to congratulate you. You made an excellent investment with your Flame Wallet. Now, before you get started, you probably have a few questions that I want to answer. You got your Flame Wallet, came in the mail, looks like this. Hopefully you opened it up, found the directions. That's where you found the URL to come to this website so you can find a little bit more about your Flame Wallet. This is what your Flame Wallet looks like. If you'll notice, there's a secret flap inside your Flame Wallet, and this is how all the magic happens. Inside the Flame Wallet right here, there's two little panels. There's a magnet on one side, and on the other side, there's a flint mechanism. These pads is where the lighter fluid goes. And when you want to ignite the, the uh, flame, you're going to strike down with your index finger. Now, before you do that, you're going to need to go out and purchase something. A bottle of Zippo fluid. I like Zippo fluid. You can use Rhinesol, just another kind of lighter fluid. Zippo is my favorite. I think it does work the best. You take a bottle of Zippo fluid. It shouldn't cost you much. This one cost $1.89. You take a bottle of Zippo fluid and you're going to apply it on your flame wallet on the two pads. A very light little bit of Zippo fluid on each one. Enough for it to soak in. I usually like to put another one on there too. Now I do this every morning when I get up in the morning. It's routine. It's like I brush my teeth, I put uh, the gel in my hair, I put uh, Zippo fluid in my wallet. It'll become normal. Now when you want to ignite the flame wallet, you take your index finger and strike down. You have to go like that to get both sides lit. Now, when you open it up, because of the magnet there, it should keep it closed. Now, there's a couple things I want to point out to you. One is if you're not lighting up right away, you're going to need to take a screwdriver and adjust the screw. What there is is there's a flint in there with a spring. And I have a little bit of one right here. I'll bring it up to the camera to show you. This is what it looks like. Now I'll put a white background behind it. It is a, a spring with a flint on top of it. Just like that. That is your flint. That gets screwed in into the wallet right there and then there's a screw that goes on the end of it. That's your mechanism. So you're going to screw it in to adjust the tension. If you're not getting a consistent flame right off the bat, the first thing I want you to do before you email me is to take a screwdriver and adjust the spring tension with your flint mechanism. It's going to take a little bit of getting used to, but hopefully once you get the tension right, it should light every time. Right now, see, it's not quite enough, but a little bit more. This should get it every time, just like that. Perfect. Do you have any questions? Oh, <laughs> feel free to email me. Congratulations on your purchase. Tell your friends where you got them. Everyone's going to want to know. FlameWallet.com. Thank you.